Hey now, Steve Severs from Bionic Buzz. We're here at NAM 2019 Media Day. It's gonna be amazing. Let's go see who we can talk to. Hi there, I'm Rick Hines. I'm the product development manager for Fender Amplifier. Cool, so what are you guys showing off here at NAM 2019? Well, we got a ton of stuff, uh, you know, that down here in the, the NAM area. We can only fit so much stuff, so we brought a couple of our favorite uh, stories to tell you about. Uh, new American performers are coming out. Um, I am the amp dude, but I did get the lowdown on these guitars. Um, we've got some great new finishes. Um, we've got new pickups, the Yosemite pickups. They've been uh, redesigned. Uh, different magnets, a different feel, a little bit more aggressive. Um, I really like them a lot. Uh, the cool thing about the humbucker version is uh, they have this new split coil system on the uh, guitar. Lift it like that. Um, I don't know how they did it, but I know this much. I know generally when you split a humbucker and a single coil in the in-between position, the humbucker gets weaker, therefore your, your in-between sounds a little bit more weak than it would be if it was three single coils. Uh, the new process that they've done is it actually increases the output of the humbucker when it becomes a single coil. That way when you go the in-between stage, it sounds great. So like I said, is we've got a really cool matte finish, so seafoam or a surf green matte finish, really great. The old 70s headstock, kind of a cool silver logo, so it's a nice little twist on uh, the 70s stuff. And then uh, as far as amplifiers go, I've got here on there this little guy, the LT25 Mustang. Uh, the Mustang GTs have done really well for us. There are tons of great effects, um, great amp sounds. Um, really, real fun modeler. So what we want to do is give something to uh, the, the the beginner. So the LT25 is 25 watts. It's got 30 presets built in with an extra bonus 20 presets hidden when you go to um, save a file. You can actually replace it with some of the other presets we did. Um, it's super cool. Uh, it doesn't have Bluetooth. It doesn't have Wi-Fi. So someone that maybe is not as uh, comfortable with technology, it's really easy to spin the knob, get great sounds at a really low volume. Perfect for practicing, playing at home in your study. Um, a lot of fun, and the entry price is great. So it's you know barely pocket change, really. You got pedals. Yeah, we've also got a, a new batch of pedals. We debuted our pedals last year, and um, we've had a great success. And and really that comes down to the fact that Stan Cody. Um, who designed these pedals is an amazing musician, guitarist, keyboardist, and he approached this in a really unique way. So all of our all of our pedals aren't based on anything; they're unique uh, things that, he, that they're from his mind. So this time around, we got some really cool stuff. Last year, we put out a reverb. They said, "Why why don't you guys do like a traditional spring reverb?" Well, we had it in the works, and we wanted to make sure we got it right, so it sounded like a real spring reverb. So the Treverb has Fender Tremolo and Fender Reverb. It's got three different presets for both. So your favorite 63, 65, or plate reverb sound great. Tremolo-wise, you've got the Opto, you've got the Bias Tremolo, and then you've got the old Harmonic Tremolo, which is actually a really cool sound that Fender used to do in the 60s. Um, we've got that. The Pinwheel does some great Leslie sounds. We've got a Phaser that does some killer stuff, great chorus. Um, and then we've got uh, Downtown Express, which is like an all-in-one base, base station for bass players on the go. XLR out, um, it's got a, a silent tuner, it's got EQ, it's got overdrive. It's pretty much one of those things you just grab to the gig and go. So tons of new stuff. We're expanding the pedal line. Uh, we mean business. It's, it's serious stuff and they sound great. My name is Billy Martinez. I'm the Vice President of Acoustic and Squire Divisions. Cool. So what are you showing off here today? Today we're showing off our new American Acoustasonic Telecaster. I'm super excited about this. This is the first acoustic guitar that we've uh, made here in Corona, California. So it'll be the first USA made guitar coming out of that factory. Um, we're super excited about it because it definitely takes the acoustic guitar and the, uh, the technology used inside of acoustic guitars and kind of boosts it into the future. So it uses the traditional um, stylings and craftsmanship of an acoustic guitar but it also lends to have different voice pairings of different body shapes of acoustic guitars, all the way to actually having a full-blown electric sound that Fender's known for in a clean tone. So, really excited about it. Nice, and when is it gonna be available? Uh, it's available starting tomorrow in stores and online at 10 a.m. Uh, our stores and our dealers that have bought into it are locked and loaded and ready to go. Awesome, cool, thank you so much. Yeah, no problem.